Always looking for opportunities. He disabled tower. Okay, guys. Oh. Hmm, something fishy. Hey guys, I'm Shark Zone, and in today's video, we are doing a how to play uh, Lux in the mid lane, where we'll be going over everything, like how to play the early, mid, and late game, how to team fight, all that good stuff. So, like usual, if you enjoy, like, comment, subscribe. Let's get into this laning phase where we're where we got countered, and we're playing versus Vladimir, which kind of sucks because. He kind of just out sustains my poke and at the same time can tower dive me <laughs> because I'm very immobile. All right, let's just poke a little bit. We took the Durin ring, so we want to try something like that. Use my minions for the advantage there to win that trade. But again, he out sustains. So yeah, we probably shouldn't have walked that close. But since he out sustains, it's, it's very hard. Very hard to kill him or get him low. So that way you, uh, we have kill pressure. So we got a little poke there. We took the arcane comet. Wow, that still hit me. We saw he has no. Yeah, we saw he had no no W W pool. Did he take that? He took W level two. Interesting, because yeah, we got him really low there. He's going to stay. And then I'm guessing he's just going to try to sustain off the minions. Uh, Lux. Oh, God, we missed. Lux ne isn't necessarily the most meta mage you could be playing. But she's like the best for beginners. Beginners mid, mid lane. Ooh, don't take my cannon, please. Nah, you can't. No, no, I missed the cannon. Volley. Oh my. Okay, okay. Volley. Nice. We're still winning in CS. Okay, Vladimir's still here. Let's just try to get a little poke off right there. Poke while farming. And then run away from Vlad when, yeah, his, his stacks are all up like that. Mm -hmm. Toss out the E. Get an auto trade in there. And ideally, you just want to farm up for the mid game where Lux is most strong. Well, let's see if we can get a Q, a, a sneaky Q onto the Vlad here. Nope, we couldn't. The wave shoving under his tower. Uh, let's see. He doesn't have Q up. So we went for that. Once you get two points into your E, it actually does a decent amount of damage. So that's just one thing to note. But your first back, if you don't have a lot of gold, is always going to be kind of awkward. Usually people get the Dark Seal or Durin Ring. Which is what we're going to be doing because we're getting Magi's. Make sure we don't miss out on the cannon. Alright, let's see. Let's see what he does to get the cannon. Ah, uh, pools. Pulls and we get some damage off. Okay. Nice. We're probably not going to be able to kill him, but. Ah. Perfection. We use the fact that we have a barrier, so we might be able to win this. Oh, okay. If we landed the Q, that would have been easier. We still want that. All right. But, uh, yeah, the reason why Vlad uh, didn't expect to get hit by the Q is because it passes through one minion and then hits another target. So, yeah, let's recall, start building towards our Ludens. And we have enough for a lost chapter, which is perfect. And then we can get potions and a vision ward. Actually, never mind. Well, we could get boots, technically. We don't need it to speed back to lane. So, it's just good to prioritize the boots and then vision ward because if we trade once and then the vlad gets us like at half hp trades twice i have to recall so you always need potions which is why vlad got the refillable there so we're back in lane with double buffs to drag us up we might want to fight for that just in general vlad or the the lux pick it can't you can't really roam 
You're not good at it. Very reliant on landing your Q. And if you don't land your Q, you're a useless roamer. So let's just try to get some E poke there. And whenever our E is up, prioritize poking the Vlad over... Uh, prioritize poking the Vlad over actually Eing the minions. Because... Uh, yikes. And... Prior... <laughs> only throw the E when the Vlad actually goes for our minion because that's best. Okay, he's level 6. We gotta be careful. First cheesy all-ins. Let's see. Nice. Ah. Uh, oh, killing spree. Sweet. I'm glad Volley didn't take it. I would not like a Volley to take that. And I guess he can he can tax if he wants to. Because he gave me the kill. So yeah. Alright, let's shove that under tower and actually drag us up. So we might want to take that. Let's go volley. Take it. Can't do much to clear or actually take the drag quickly. So I'm just going to recall here. Get boots, dark seal. Instead of just getting blasting wand because. I'm sure that does help but. They're just yeah. Dark seal and boots is just better option. Than just raw damage. Yeah. Get the drag team. And then get a pick on the Lilia. They're going to be all there, so I don't know. This could be good, could be bad. I have R up in 5 seconds, so we might be able to get a snipe. Let's see. Whoa, my bad. The phone rang. Alrighty. Alrighty, we hung that up. Oh no, we had to focus the Soraka or else we do no damage. My bad, I wasn't really able to commentate over that. Ah, Soraka, we really have to focus her because, yeah, I got distracted a little bit. Once the Soraka goes down, then we can focus the Shen here and get this. Yeah, we have barrier. Come on, team. Come on, team. <laughs> Where's my backup at? If I landed all my abilities, it probably wouldn't be that close. But, yeah, everything turned out well. All we're trying to do here is shove it in and then recall. There we go. All right, we're back. We're back. We're back. Uh, We don't have enough for Ludin, so we can get Blasting Wand, Magic Pen Boots, and then head back to lane. If we were really losing, maybe we would have went, I don't know, Merc Treads. Something to help with magic resist, but we're, we're stomping this lane. 52 CS to 25, and we have a level lead, so let's, let's expand on this. Of course, you had to burn the flash. Uh, I, thought, I thought you were going to walk back towards your, your tower. I guess not. Over time, it just becomes a game of if you can, po how well you can poke, which separates the good and, and bad Lux players. So, yeah. <laughs> Practice makes perfect with landing your abilities. But just in general, Especially in like the lower ranks. How you land your abilities is just by waiting for them to go for a minion. And then tossing out your Q or E. That will work like three-fourths of the time. <laughs> Most of the time it actually works. So I mean, if you want them to think you're scripting, do that and right away you'll be like silver three. <laughs> no joke. We have no R, but we're so ahead. We want to make the roam here. Trying to get the... the actual. We're actually trying to get the... We're trying to prioritize uh, killing the Soraka. That's a rip. Shen ulted. Should have expected that. Rift is up. Since now we know that we, we actually can't roam bot. Or else things like that will happen. 
We could just stay mid and then push our lead more. Even with even if I had R, the the Shen ult just did too much. So uh not much I could do. We even landed our Q on one of the squishy. I think it was the vein. We should probably take Rift. Probably take Rift, they take Drag. Because Volley's topside. I know you guys were going for tower platings, but please. Can we get a ward? Oh, you guys are really, really smart. <laughs> missed the cannon, and I missed another minion. It's all good. We're just trying to get some tower platings mid. Ward it. Oh, I might be. I literally might be able to steal. Who knows? Oh, I couldn't steal. I was too late. I was just way too late. Let's go. What are you guys running from? What? You guys are running from people? We win this. No, we are not peeling back. If they want to fight, we fight. Let's see. No mobility Vlad, so... Uh, yeah. <laughs> good stuff, team. Good stuff. Our R is on a 42 second cooldown. Which is, like, super useful. It's basically always going to be up for any team fight. And it no longer resets cooldown off kill, but it just has, yeah, overall a really low cooldown. Which is why Lux can be really powerful if played in the right hands. Let's take some minions here. And then recall soon. Okay, okay, okay. What's up, everyone? Anyone coming? Vlad is here. We already took first tower, so... We just want to eventually take mid tower. But now is a perfect time to recall. Because we can get Ludin's Echo. And then hopefully get Magi's. Yep. Ludin's, Magi's, and a Vision Ward. We no longer need potions because... Well, we're not going to get touched. We're, we're just going to stay super far back. And we got that nice lead mid while my team takes Rift. So. We could just start shove, shove, shoving. I mean, if we really wanted to. We always use it. We always use... We always use... Oh, man. Too <laughs> close. Yikes. Our W to actually trade because it just... It literally just re redu reducts... Or makes us take less damage. So always use W, especially because it's on a 10 second cooldown. And we can 1v all. <laughs> we can 1v all mid. We're just going to stay super far back while our team goes top and bot. Takes all the objectives they can. Okay. He's going to W. Pop him with E. Shoot out the R. Get him. And, yeah, they can't do anything anymore. How to play Lux 101. And, yeah, if they have an assassin team comp, that's, that's going to be super rough. So always be careful for those. We get tower here. Look at top lane. A bunch of jokesters they are. Little do they know. Putting all their energy mid. And uh, bot. But they haven't looked at top. We probably got inhib. Because of the rift take. We got one. Ah, we gotta step out of that. Using barrier and W. To just tank the most damage possible triple kill oh see 
Good job. Vlad's probably coming. I don't know if we can 1v1 him. Six second R. No, he's not coming for me, though. Yeah. Recall. Uh, Morello's is, like, such a solid item to get. Because of the magic penetration. Uh, yeah, we do need it for the grievous wounds. Because of the Vladimir. But, uh, yeah. Fourth item. Third, fourth item. Death cap. Always get death cap. Because it just adds on to your, uh... Your burst, really. And then at this point, it's just a game of farming farming kills and poking them off objectives like tower, drag, and then also going for like the risky, yeah, the, the risky cues because it's on a six point, uh, yeah, six point something cooldown. But also note that if you do queue, you're not going to have anything. Wow. You're not going to have anything to peel for yourself with. So just be wary of that. 30 second R. It's worth it. We're zoning the Vlad or the Shen off of drag. He probably recalled and then he's looking to R. He's looking to R to the fight. Yep. <laughs> Abusing lack of vision to just take... As many opportunities like that possible where you get a kill. Huh? Toss out the E for the slow. Oh, one shot him with my R. E poke? What does that do? 300 something? Things are going well. We can't recall, even though we have like somewhat low mana, because we have nothing to recall for. We want the Needless Rod at least. So, hey, help me take this. Help me take this. I need blue buff. Tossing out the Q. We don't even need our R. Come on, help. Help. Thank you. Oh, I didn't hit the Lilia. I can't even nuke her with my R. Rip, rip, rip. I'm actually go for like a sneaky Q there. We can't even get the sneaky Q. I'll sing out the E. Always looking for opportunities. He disabled tower. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. <laughs> Good fight, but you know. I think it could have been a bit better. Yeah, we're going to recall here and get our Needless Rod. We don't want to greed for too much, and they're just going to wave clear. Slowly but surely sieging them down. Baron is up, or we can just siege them down. <laughs> Pick one of the two. The reason why we can siege them down so easily is because we have Lux. I'm like the poke. I'm like the engage. I'm everything. Super powerful pick. If played in the right hands. Snipe! Oh, I only got one. I thought I would get two. Uh -huh. Wing the team. To, you know, peel for them, supposedly. We don't want to be alone here. Oh, got the Soraka. We're legendary. We might be able to nuke the Lilia with just one R. Yikes. We, we sure were close. Yeah, we sure were close. Anywho. I want enough for the Rabadon's death cap. <laughs> I do. 10 seconds. 8 seconds before we have to go for another snipe. Try me. I mean, I, I've, I have a lot of defenses to give myself. No, definitely misplayed that. My bad, my bad, team. I'm assuming that everyone's looking for the drag play. We're just going to solo blue buff. So that way we never run out of mana. 
Uh, place a ward right here. Usually, you want blue ward mid game if you're even or behind. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, that just one shot him. Because you don't want to be face checking stuff. Let's see if we can go for a steal. Yeah. Woo! Damage. Stole it. That time we stole it. Man, we're just so poggers. It's insane. All right, then. Yeah, that's that's how you play Lux 101, really. GG, well played. Vlad is up in nine. I don't know if he can protect. But again, if you enjoy, like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell. And yeah. He's going to W. And as soon as that runs out, boo! Very, very good champ. Very, very good champ.